Hi, curl friends. Naturally Rhonda here. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's wash and go, I decided to use two Aunt Jackie's products. I start, well, let me put on my glasses so I can see. I started with Aunt Jackie's Curl La La Defining Curl Custard. And then I topped that with Aunt Jackie's Don't Shrink Flaxseed Elongating Curling Gel. Now I've used the gel before, but I've never used the Curl A La. I was very interested to try it out and see how it worked. And I really love the combination together. So if you would like to see how I achieve this moisturized and defined wash and go, please keep watching. Okay, let's get started. My hair is freshly shampooed, conditioned, detangled, and deep conditioned. So let me just take this down. I tried, I tried a new way of detangling my hair today, so it's already sectioned. And I actually really liked it, so I'm gonna try it a few more times. And if it still turns out this way, I'm gonna record a detangling video to show y'all how I did it because I really like the way it came out. But I'm just gonna start with my first section and of course my water bottle because I like to apply my products, the majority of my products on wet to damp hair. Okay. I'm gonna go right in with the curl -a la Taking about this much. This is my first time using the curl -a la and oh. It feels nice. Has some slip to it for sure. Feels definitely feels moisturizing. Okay, let me go ahead and subsection and then apply some more. I've seen some people just do one product wash and goes with this curl a la. And um, because it is a curl defining cream, so I'm sure that you could do just this product and not go in with the gel over top. But since it's the summer, I want some more hold. So I'm still gonna go in with the gel after I finish with this, but this is nice. My hair feels super soft and super moisturized. So I'm going to just continue along. I'm sorry y'all, I forgot to mention what I shampooed, conditioned, and deep, deep conditioned my hair with. So I shampooed and conditioned with the Cream of Nature Clay and Charcoal Shampoo and Conditioner. And I deep conditioned with the Shea Moisture um, Raw Shea Butter Deep Conditioner. So just for those who are wondering. Your love 
conditioner in the curl -a -la. and now i'm gonna go in with the gel the don't shrink flaxseed elongating curling gel okay so the same thing i have my four sections and then i do my subsections and i like to start from the back because it just falls better that way for me so i'm gonna start from the back and then work my way to the front and i am going to wet each section again as well all right okay so like i said i like to apply my products on wet hair so i'm re-wetting this and then this is it's a typical gel but um I really do like it so I'm going in with about this much gel at first and then I'm gonna this gel which is a bit surprising because it's definitely a thick gel it's not a jelly but it does have some slip and then going with my sub sections to really work it through add a little more remember don't neglect your roots you want to get your product on the full length of your hair root to end and you don't know
so the product is all in. This is what it's looking like, wet. I'm going to sit under my hooded dryer for about 45 minutes to an hour, and then I'll come back. Okay, so it's not 100% dry, so I don't wanna mess with it too much, but these are my results. And I love them. So I'm super excited. I'm glad that I tried this. Again, this was an Aunt Jackie's wash and go today. I used the Curl La La, the fine, the fine and curl custard, and the flaxseed recipe don't shrink elongating curling gel. So I'm just gonna air dry the rest of the way. I have somewhere to go, so I'm gonna air dry outside. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.